Hello everyone, we are from True Maths and in this video we are going to solve question number 6 of exercise 13.1 and the question says a medicine capsule is in the shape of a cylinder with two hemispheres stuck to each of its end the length of the entire capsule is 14 millimeter and the diameter of the capsule is 5 millimeter you have to find its surface now this is the complete capsule which is in a form of cylinder this is a cylinder where it is stuck with two hemispheres on both ends obviously this is 3D figure not 2D so first of all you have to imagine this now you have to find the surface area of this capsule and I have already told you if you want to find the surface area of anything where more than two or more than two surfaces are attached to each other you need to find the area of that surface which is visible to you okay now obviously if you want to find the total surface area of this capsule that will be equals to the this area which is the curved surface area curved surface area of the cylinder plus this is again the curved surface area of a hemisphere plus this is again a curved surface area of hemisphere and this hemisphere and this hemisphere are equal so if you want to find the surface area of this plus the surface area of this this will join will become the surface area of complete sphere so the uh, so the surface area of sphere this is basically the half hemisphere and this is hemisphere if these two attach will form a complete sphere now what you have to find the curved surface area of the cylinder and curved surface area of the cylinder will be 2 pi r h and the surface area of the sphere is 4 pi r square now if you want to solve this instead of directly solving this first of all you can take common in that case you will have to solve the common part only once so if I take 2 pi r as common so from 2 pi r h if 2 pi r is taken out only h will remain and plus from 4 pi r square from 4 can be written as 2 multiplied by 2 and if 2 is taken out only 2 will remain inside the bracket pi is taken out and from 2 r which is r square if 1 r is taken out only one R will remain inside the bracket. Now, there is nothing common in this. So, you have to take everything which, uh, which is common. Which you have to take out which is common. Now, you can substitute the values. Before that, you need to find the height of the cylinder as well as the radius for this sphere. So, it is given that the diameter of this sphere is, the diameter is, 5 millimeter so obviously the radius will be 5 by 2 millimeters now the radius is 5.5 by 2 millimeters which is equals to 2.5 millimeters now if this complete height a complete length of this capsule is 14 millimeter and if this is the radius so this must also be the radius for this hemisphere and the radius is equal to 2.5 so this is 2.5 similarly this radius will also be equal to 2.5 so this is 2.5 this is 2.5 so this complete is 10 so from 14 meter if 10 is my uh, subtracted only uh, sorry if 5 is subtracted only this value will be the height of this cylinder so if 5 is subtracted from 14 so this will be 9 millimeter so the length of this cylinder will be 9 millimeters so now I can substitute the values here this is 2 22 upon 7 and the radius here is 5 by 2 height is 9 and 2 and the radius is again 5 by 2 this can be cancelled this is 5 to the 10 
and this is 9 this can be cancelled so now this will be 110 upon 7 is multiplied by 9 plus 5 is 14 now this can be cancelled 2 times and 2 multiplied by 110 will be equals to 220 this is millimeter square so the total surface area of this capsule will be equal to 220 millimeter square so this is how you can solve this question i hope you have understood how to solve this if you like this video please subscribe to our channel and if you have any problem in maths you can directly contact to us the phone number the email address and the whatsapp number is given below in the description thank you